Hi, this is Nicolas Narbais from the Technical Account Manager team. And today, to finish the tips and tricks videos on Node.js and APM, I'd like to speak about Analyze Span. Let's quickly go to the code to show you how to quickly add an analyzed span. The main difference here, compared to what we've seen in previous videos, is the line 263, where we put analytics to true. As always, we want to add additional context, and so we want to set up some additional attributes to our span. Go back to our application to generate some traffic. Then we can go back to the Datadog platform to see what has changed. If you go to a traditional flame graph, we can see that the new user authorization span has been added. However, since it's not a root span, none of the attributes can be made searchable. If we now go to the Analyze Spans view, we will see new spans as added called user authorization. If you click on any of those, we can see that the attributes can now be made searchable by creating a facet. This could, for instance, help us to better understand and do some search about how a method is currently used. We can also use this new created resource to have new statistics around total number of requests, errors, and latency. Overall, this could help you to create new search capabilities around the method and also get some statistics about utilization and performance of this method.